I'll tell no tomatoes. They put tomatoes in my shit. And the thing say no fucking tomatoes, right? Yeah. Deluxe with American no tomato. You want to go back up there? For what? They put tomatoes on your shit. I know that, but it's okay. But it says clearly no tomato, and they put tomatoes on there. Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn, I did just push the record button. What's I'm good, JB squad? squad? It's your boy, Jay. It's your boy, Bill. What's up, y'all? We are here with a mukbang. This is our second mukbang, actually. Really? Might start doing some of these. You remember we did that mukbang, the Gates mukbang? Oh, yeah, I forgot we did that. As you guys can tell by the title, this is not just the mukbang, but our anniversary by our wedding. Yeah, and get married. So, oh, let me let me get my stuff set up. Yeah, if y'all haven't had the Polynesian sauce by Chick Fil A, try it. Try it. So, fire, change your life. My friend told me about it. Change your life. Okay. Damn, that ain't bro. I usually don't get cheese on this though. Like, I mean, I like cheese, but I no, I love cheese on my sandwich. That's I know, mess. but like, they don't never normally put that on there. This chick play it. Yeah. We should have went to the one by the house. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, we starting off first. Well, okay, yeah. We decided on um, getting married on July 23rd of, of this, this year, year, 2021. And then I thought that it would be kind of tight. Okay, so we look, it's not like any meaning behind the date or anything. He wanted to do June, but I said we should do July because it's already like enough events going on in June and stuff. So we agree on July. And um, we chose July 23rd because this year, July 23rd is on a Friday. Next year, July 23rd will be on a Saturday. Saturday. The reason we're doing that is because I thought, you know, like, why don't we get married on a day this year? And then next year on our one year, like, you know, anniversary of us being married, we can have our wedding ceremony. Yeah. I think that'd be kind of tight. Like, that's dope. So it's like two, a cel two celebrations in one, like you know, our wedding, and then like celebrating our one year of marriage. Like that's tight. I think that's so fucking tight. It is though. So um, that's what we're gonna do. So yeah, July twenty third, twenty twenty one is the day we're gonna get married, and then July twenty third, twenty twenty two is gonna be our big wedding. I can't really say big wedding because it's not gonna be like too big. It's gonna be like close family and friends, probably something like under like a hundred people. Yeah, none too big. And then who knows? COVID restrictions might still be enforced by the end. I pray to God not. I'm not wearing no mask in my wedding. I'm sorry. What? Like, mm -mm. so I just pray things are better by then. Yeah, but um, yeah, whatever. But it took us a while to decide because you know now that you know it's like COVID cases are really dying down a little bit. Mm-hmm. And, you know, they got, like, we decided that, you know, why wait longer? We can just do it, like, within a year or so. Yeah, because it's just, like, even if the cases don't die down, even if they just, like, keep them being around, I'm just not going to keep holding it off, like. Right. It's when people still getting married, I feel like. I feel like it'll be okay, like, you know. But, I mean, I don't know. I just don't. Yeah, we're not All gonna we bring do, it or nothing. Like, yeah, we're just gonna put it in God's hands and go from there, and then spray about it at this point. But yeah, and then like I held off for so long too because I don't want like to plan it and pay a deposit and all that, and then say like we get shut down again, and it's just like they don't try to refund our money back and stuff like that. Like, that's, that's, that's gonna be a big issue, right? Like, I'll tear that whole venue up. Won't nobody be getting married there. <laughs> no, for real. Like, yeah, like, that would that would like really piss me off, for real. Cause I feel like people should be entitled to get their money back. Like, that's like a natural disaster. Like, mm -hmm. so it's just like that's something we can't control. You know, so it's just like I feel like it's only fair. Like now, I understand why people charge deposits and stuff like that. Because I knew myself, 
to my photography. But if it's an issue, like a natural disaster or something like that, or if it's something on my end to where I can't do it or host the event or whatever, you're definitely getting your money back. Right. Right. Which, which, which I think is really fair. It is. It's only right. But everybody's not the same. So. Right. Whatever. We got colors for our wedding too. Yes. It's going to be like a hunter olive green with gold and uh, white. And you know what made us come with the color ideas? Like it's something different because it's gonna be a game. Very different. Very different. And you know, so we just try to do something different. You know, try some different colors a little bit because you know, usually people get married wearing basic wedding colors like black and white and some, like navy whatever. But we just try to do a little different. And then on top of that, we wanted to have our wedding in the fall. But since it looks like that's probably not gonna happen no more, we still gonna have them fall colors. Period. Cause we love fall colors. Man. So yeah. I love me some olive green. That is my that's the favorite that's my only favorite green I love wearing. And yeah, I love olive green. Yeah. So that's that. So we got the date, we got the colors. We are in between like venues here. Like where we're at. But we do got our mind on one particular venue though. That. Yeah, we got to go tour it again. Yeah. But, yeah. Because um, we've been there before. My sister had her wedding there. And it's funny. She had her wedding there two years ago. As soon as he walked in. Boom! We got to have our wedding here too. <laughs> Wasn't nowhere near engaged or nothing. <laughs> just was already playing and stuff. Like he just seen the future or something. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. That's probably gonna be where we're gonna go more than likely, but we still gonna have our eyes open to other options though, still. But most likely, that might be the venue that we might choose to go with. Yeah, it's not really like nice venue though. It is like, yeah. and like, I'm oh, like, my bad. <laughs> but nah, I love the area. The area, I love the area. Yeah, but if we, damn it, <laughs> but if we do go there, we're gonna take y'all with you. Like, we'll make a vlog, like, uh, you know. We'll post it so y'all can see, like, you know, what it looked like and stuff like that. We really haven't gotten nothing else for real, for real out just yet. Like, we gotta make a guest list. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta find a uh, photographer. We gotta, well, I'm not doing that. <laughs> it's impossible for you to record y'all on that way. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm not doing that. Then you know, we gotta get catered. We gotta find a DJ or whatever. We gotta. You know, it's a lot. Playing the wedding is gonna be a lot. Thankfully, yeah. we got help. Yeah. So we got a couple people in mind for like a caterer and all that stuff like that. Yeah. I mean, for the most part, we good. Yeah. But at the same time, you don't want to overwhelm yourself playing the wedding, though. You don't want to do that. But yeah. So mm -hmm. I don't know. That's pretty much it for real. We just had to, you know, keep y'all updated about it. And we had to do a video anyway. I was like, you know, we just came up with this. Actually, like the other day, like we started talking about it again and figuring stuff out. And yeah, so we doing a mukbang about it. Oh yeah, we definitely got to drop some pounds before this wedding for sure man i mean like my body is cool our body is cool this is the part that we're worried about our middle section everything else is cool with 20 pounds no more than that yeah whatever it takes i don't know how much that's gonna be whatever it takes to get this off that's <laughs> just what it's gonna be roseanne voice oh, man this is my happy weight <laughs> nah, that happy way gotta go now. <laughs> Unless you wanna be looking like Big Mama in a suit. Oh, oh no! Cause I know. So, yeah, that is. I'm trying to keep talking so like we can eat mm -hmm. and finish our food on our. Damn, you finished your food, so damn, I, it's just me. I was hungry. I couldn't. Man. But no. Nah, well, 
Shit. <laughs> that is the end of our mukbang. I'm in my <laughs> Chick fil A. And next time, if y'all watching this, the Chick fil A that y'all work at that we can't. But if you wanted to fry, just say that. I'm sorry, I was hungry still. Thank you, though. <laughs> if you're watching this video and you work at the Chick fil A that we just came from, if you ever see this video, maybe 10, 20 years from now, and you remember us from that night, I just called to say, <laughs> you. I just called to tell you. I forgot the rest of that song, damn. Oh, oh well, you be yeah. Cause no tomatoes and y'all still put tomatoes. Y'all messed up, Chick-fil-A. It's supposed to be y'all pleasure. Right. That wasn't y'all's pleasure to say no tomato, but still add a tomato. I'm still tripping off that and that wasn't even my food. But, but that, that sound was too damn good. I'm gonna I'm go back and get another one for real. If you want mine, you can have it. You full? I'm full. I already, you know, I told you I ate not too long ago. Uh, you can have mine. I want a yes. whole. I want a whole. Sandwich. Boy, this is like three. You no, like off of it. So the fuck what? Like you don't kiss me and be all down my throat. I don't want your teeth in. Boy, don't say it like that. Okay. I'm Do you it. want the sandwich and fries? You shit. You ate my fries. You might as well eat the sandwich. Fries is like an appetizer. So, you can have my sandwich. Okay, I'm, I'll eat it later. Eat it, anime. <laughs> See, this is, what, this is what I'm afraid of. <laughs> uh, buddy, you can lock in. <laughs> okay. And this is just, this is half of the key. Like, this ain't even the whole lock, key, smith, whatever thing. No, I'm talking about this is just half. This is just the engagement. In uh, July, when we get the real ones, oh, it's sealed and deal. I mean, it's sealed, signed, sealed, delivered. That contract is valid. Yep. <laughs> we hope you guys enjoyed our mukbang. If you want us to start doing more mukbangs, let us know, because we like to eat. We like to eat. <laughs> right. Ooh, we should, we should do a buffet. A mukbang or a buffet? I think that'd be awkward, because there's going to be people watching us. We're going to be talking. We're recording. Boy, that's people. Shit. Boy, that, no, that's going to be too awkward. And I don't even care about stuff like that, but we're going to be... Now, I mean, well, I guess, like, but that'd be more like of a vlog. Maybe. Maybe not. But, yeah, so... We love you guys. Yes, we're on the road to 400. Oh my God. Please share this video to your, well, probably not this video because it's nothing too exciting in this video besides our wedding. But I mean, you know, we got other funny videos and more funny videos coming from us. Right. And yeah, so just share, comment, like, subscribe. Let us know what you guys think about the mukbangs. If y'all want to see more, let us know. We'll do those and give us a topic to talk about. And you know, follow us on Instagram. The link will be listed below. And you can also follow our personal Instagrams. DM us for the prank ideas. Cause you know we need them. It's your boy Jay. It's your boy Vail. And we are signing off. Peace. See y'all in the next video. We love y'all. Deuces. Peace.